Ow! Uh, ow! Baby, I hurt myself! Good morning, Montenegro. I just woke up like five minutes ago. I'm fully dressed. I just woke up from Lustica Bay in Montenegro and today is going to be our first whole day here. I'm very excited to explore, to discover, to see even though I'm like still a bit of a sleepy face, can you tell? We're gonna fix that soon because the excitement levels are high. So let's get going for breakfast. Let me just show you our view from the early morning. Oh, this is so nice. Like, look at this. My boyfriend is loving it. And on top of that, baby, how excited are you to be back in Montenegro? I'm very happy. I'm just so tired. Same. But coffee, coffee, coffee. guys breakfast view do we agree it's a 10 out of 10 love it i want to have a look what are oh baby burek you have to try burek it's like a traditional pillow pastry with meat love it then we have the standard kind of like breakfast dishes i feel like something let's see here mm, delicious and some pastries well i mean what can we say right yep i would definitely like to book is this part treatment let's see need to see what i want breakfast done it's a beautiful day today like loving it i don't want to miss one second of the sunshine so we're gonna go to the beach. We reserved four beds for our little group. And also my childhood best friend is coming for a coffee today. So I think it's going to be a wonderful day. My outfit of the day, let me show you. The Miu Miu skirt, this skirt I've been wearing like non-stop, no? Yeah. Non-stop, love it. My new Loewe tank top with anagram. I got my elephant pendant back on. Love it so much. I will link it below. You guys always ask me for this one. Sunglasses are my favorite. Off white, beach bag with a lot of beach stuff, and the row Ginza sandals. Now, let's go get a bikini on and enjoy the sun. It's beach o'clock. I think it's one actually. But since we woke up late, we are not hungry yet. Normally, we would kind of have lunch we around this time. Up at nine, my love. Well, yeah, which is late. On the holidays or Saturday? Nine is not early. Everything like after eight for me is that we woke up late. Yeah, but not on the holidays in the weekend. Okay. Filippo, how happy are you to be back in Montenegro? From? One to ten. Ten. Filippo wants to extend our holidays in Montenegro. My friend over there. Toza in the water. No, Filippo says okay. the water is a little bit cold, but he loves it. So far, your favorite sea, huh? Yeah, I love, I love uh, this part of the sea because it's really fresh. Fresh sea, it's not... Like the Mediterranean well, Sea was so hot. Too hot, huh? <laughs> yeah. So Adriatic. But you also like it because part of Italian Sea is also Adriatic Sea. Well, yeah. The, the Your west, part. The west side, yeah. Your part. There's a beautiful lighthouse over there. We're enjoying and we're planning and waiting for my friends to come so we can have a coffee. Guys, it's been a while. I am dressed up and it's a bit of a funny story actually. This is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing the YSL jumpsuit. I will link it below. The, the mirror is a little bit like off-white so I don't know if you'll be able to see properly. The YSL shoes I basically dressed up. We're going tonight to Porto Montenegro. Let me tell you the story. I told you I've never been to Porto Montenegro before. I've heard about it. It's basically like a port as the name suggests in Montenegro with a lot of like designer shops and things like that and we kind of decided last minute to book a restaurant to go there that's what we're doing and my friends i asked them okay how much should i dress up from one to ten because i'm like i have all sorts of things in my suitcase and honestly i've never been to this place plus i was just more asking for like you know in general they said you know don't dress up too much eight out of ten this is my eight out of ten i dressed I did my makeup and I'm waiting for them to be ready. Of course, I'm the only girl and I'm the first one that's ready. 
and um, yeah just waiting now we're going out and I will show you a little bit of Porto Montenegro tonight the jewelry I've been wearing a lot lately it's as always my Cartier Love Pave ring that I wear on my pinky my Bulgari Serpenti watch I, this I wear when I'm like more dressed up and so on just now in the hot days because I don't know I kind of it's quite like light my love bracelet and then I have my two rings this is the Justin Clou Pave ring as well as the ring that I got for my boyfriend for my birthday and my Katia Clash hoops. So that's it. Now let's go and explore Porto Montenegro. Guys, we had a dinner. I wish I've shown it to you before. I haven't because it was delicious. I mean, we ordered way too much, but it was really good. Well, Filippo really enjoyed his steak. I even had, we had way too many drinks because we we ran into some friends and they sent us drinks and I even had a glass of rakia. This is like a traditional for Serbia and also for Montenegro, Bosnia, like, you know, all the Balkan countries. We have this drink. It's so strong. And this rakia is made with grapes. In Italy, it's grappa. Si, grappa. But in Serbia and uh, Croatia, Bosnia, I don't know, Balkans, it's way better. Way better than in Italy. I'm sorry, all of my Italians, but for us, this is like a medicine. And it's really special. The place we ate at is Marea in Porto Montenegro, and the food was really delicious. I strongly, strongly recommend it. Good morning from Montenegro. We are today heading for breakfast in a different spot than yesterday and also going to the beach, right? Yep. I think Buggy is waiting downstairs, so we gotta go. I unfortunately have to do a little bit of work um, at the restaurant, but just a tiny, 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 tiny little bit. And then I will be enjoying the rest of the day. I will show you the outfit of the day when we get to the port because I'm not sure about the slide. How did you say it? Bonjour, <laughs> baby. How beautiful is this place, you guys? Look at love this. It. Love it, love, love it. it. I love my real gentleman carrying. The breakfast this morning is at the spot. Yesterday was at the Chedi upstairs, and now we are here. We really like the view here, so it's gonna be so beautiful. Just wanted to show you the menu, it looks really good. I'm thinking about banana and peanut smoothie bowl. Delicious, Same. right? Yeah. Mm. I mean, even like apple and yogurt sounds good. Everything sounds really good. I might have to try a few things. Guys, I hope you can see it. After breakfast, a little view on Lushtica Bay. I think it looks very pretty from here. There's the lighthouse that we saw from the beach yesterday. It's really pretty. Look at the sea. Even in the port, it's beautiful, fresh. Today, we're going to another beach and we're going through the wild paths. You see there's like uh, road markings where to go. It's very wild and I really love this because it reminds me of my childhood. Oh, we lost the rest of our group. Reminds me of my childhood because it's like where I grew up, there was this one mountain close by where we used to go for hikes and it's like that. Yes, I know it's far, but it's still part of the same place. Now we're heading on these stairs, which says maximum three people at the time. Wow, it's so beautiful! After breakfast, this is like a perfect workout. We walked quite a bit now, I think we've been walking for like 15 minutes. All with the smell of the sea. It's so beautiful. I'm for the first time ever wearing, you haven't seen it yet, my Hermes bikini with the Gucci scarf on the head. I'll link it all below so you guys can see it. My favorite sunglasses that I always wear. And at the bottom, you know the drill. And here's our beach. We are finally coming to see it. It was a slightly longer walk. You see, my boyfriend's carrying the laptop because, you know, we need it. Guys. We are currently at the Elmara beach in Lushitsa Bay. Our friends are still sleeping at the beach. We're enjoying the view and the food is just a starter. Let me tell you, there's like sushi. This is burrata and tomato, which, well, considering that I live in Italy, probably shouldn't be ordering in Montenegro, but I really love it. This is like my favorite and it's so beautiful here. Like, I love it. So far, this is my favorite beach that we've been on. Highly recommend it. Okay guys, we are now heading back there. It's a walk, the same walk that we did before. Wanna get to your clothes, gotta get it right now. I wanna push all the limits with you right now. 
I know you guys will think I'm exaggerating, but the nature here is so beautiful. I, I honestly, I love it. And I love this walk. I could do this walk every day. It reminds me of the one in Capri, but it's more easy because it's not like up the hill and the view is time. Good morning, my favorite people. New day and from today I decided I will get very serious at walking. Right? Yes, yes. Yes. We are actually having our last morning at Lushtica Bay. It was wonderful. I will tell you a little bit in a second what I think about this place. Having a breakfast at a place called The Spot and I'm having apple yogurt with like pistachios, honey is delicious, I'll tell you right away. Second coffee already, that was the first. And I mean the view, the view is always, always, always helping. Can you imagine? Are you standing so close to the edge? Why would you do that? Wow, look how many fish. Right? Look at the huge one at the bottom there. The thing they can see it. It's not uh, huge. But what is incredible is that the water at the port is clean. You know, usually the water at the port is always dirty because, of course, all the boats. Here, I feel like I'm so clumsy, for sure. You know, don't, person don't. like me yeah, don't. doesn't exactly. really. <laughs> anyway, I took my coffee to take away, as you can see. And I want to show you my outfit, baby. How about we do that? Do you like it? How much do you like my outfit today from 1 to 10? 10. I love it. it so let's start from the hat, yes. which is... Oh, I don't know okay. if he's on focus, guys, but I'm trying. It. Everybody gave me so many compliments yeah. on this hat. This uh, no, because it's the read, it really suits you. And then the sunglasses my are from? Of white. Okay. okay. I will link them below. I love them. They're like my favorite sunglasses. And then we have the top. Which is Prada. Yeah. I'll try and find it to link it below because so many of you asked me about this top from the last video, video before last. I love it. Then we have a skirt, which is actually two sizes too big, but I loved it so much and I really wanted it. It's from Coperni. But can you see that it's very big? Not but really. It yeah, it here. is big, but it's it's cute. What about the shoes? The shoes are the rock. Dun, da, da, da. And we gotta go and pack. Baby, how healthy is our little beach? Very healthy. Hmm? Very healthy. Guys, we're now in Porto Novi at the beach. The view is stunning. It's a sand beach, like I told you. We made it to Porto Novi. We changed the location. As you could have seen, we traveled with a little boat. I put on my Chanel swim. While I still had the still the favorite sunglasses. Love this look. Took off my watch. I'm sunbathing. I'm enjoying. I'm reading. We're not even thinking, right? Right. How is pizza, baby? Mm -hmm. Good. I'm gonna show you these days a little bit more from my wardrobe from Montenegro, but first things first, some food. This was such a beautiful day at the beach. I enjoyed it like every little second. It's around, what do you think is the time? 6.30. You think? Yes. We have booked dinner at our favorite Japanese at eight. I'm wearing this outfit, Chanel swim, one piece. Chanel silk pants that I've had now for two, three summers. The row slides that for sure are not for sand, but you know. My off-white sunglasses as always and the hat as always, but honestly like this hat has already paid off, no? 100%. It was such a good purchase, yeah. as well as this bag. Do you like it? I love it. Me too. Well, it fits everything. No. What's the plan for tonight? You said already dinner. Japanese at eight, we have an hour and a half. You wanted to go to the gym, are you gonna go to the gym? Ah, uh, let, let's, let's you know that. what, I'll check it out because I need to do a little bit of my yoga. Okay, and uh, that's basically it. I'm gonna have a nice long shower, film a TikTok. If you don't follow me on TikTok, you should change that and follow me. And uh, get ready for dinner and I'm really excited to like unpack the suitcase, dress up. Oh, talking about the gym, look at that. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Yeah. Guys, I was just teasing my boyfriend and I said one thing I have to be grateful to my parents because we're like saying all the things that we're grateful for. I said one thing I'm so grateful for to my parents is that I'm so smart and beautiful and the combination is very rare. I was teasing him because I wanted to hear his reaction. And he said, yeah, and let's not also forget to be grateful for the humbleness. But it was a joke. Anyway, this is where we at unpacking. This summer we're a bit of nomads because we have booked our vacation the very last minute because uh, we like to do things the way we feel, no? I don't like to do things just for the reason, like whatever. And I'm so happy because the last three days in Montenegro, which by the way is Filippo's 
favorite destination for holidays. It is. I had the best time. How much did I laugh the last three days? Yeah, so much. Because maybe you were you with your best friends. God. You miss it so much. I was with my best friends. Like literally, like I have three best friends from Serbia that I am like, they're everything to me. And I saw all three of them. Yeah, at right? the same time. At the same time. For three days. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, no, no, honestly. For me yeah. to have my boyfriend and my three best friends for like in, in at the same table, guys, it's like, I don't know, like just to, to think about it, I can smile. And uh, it's so funny because we they left all on the same plane this morning because they'll have to work and I called, like, we called each other all, like, today. That was, like, really, 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 really the best part of the holidays. Now, I'm packing because I want to have nice outfits. The only problem that I have is that after Montenegro... Ow! Uh, ow! Baby, I hurt myself! Ow! I literally have no idea, but I feel like a nerves... Like I was just standing and pressing a nerve. Baby, you know that I hurt myself is a very famous song. Yeah? From who? Guys, let me know if you know he's an amazing country singer. Let me know. I hurt myself. I hurt myself. No, I don't know. You're too young. Yeah? Thank you, baby. Anyway, um, after Montenegro, we are going to Italy. Can they classify it as south of Italy? Hmm? Baby, what is it again? Campania. Huh? Campania. Campania. Baby, what is My this? My Italian accent is getting worse and worse. Sorry, just a second. I need a doctor. Doctor on call. Probably didn't bite you now. You just probably noticed now. No, because now it's itchy. Exactly. But baby, like, how can you not know that it's a mosquito, my love? By the way, hi. To have, to have a doctor, one of the skills that you don't know. I mean, to be honest, I'm I'm not an hypochondriac, am I? No, you're very good. You're just a man. We cannot blame exactly. you. Exactly. Cannot, but cannot every time, every time there is something, you know, like... A, let's say, couple uh, thing. Like, hey, baby, what is this? Or baby, the only third year. She always has the right answer. I promise. Always. Because but how we have, do you know the answer is right? Because I have, a, you know, we have a doctor friends. Yes. Like, uh, you remember the the, um, the cough that I had uh, like uh, three yeah. months ago yeah. or whatever. And the doctor told me what to do, but you told me before. And it was a very specific antibiotic to take, whatever. So she's really, really amazing. But I think I know why. I think that the girls from Novi Sad, mm -hmm. they're kind of witches. No, baby, not at all. We're just beautiful. No, but that's, uh, yeah, you know, it's... No, but it's a well-known fact. It's, it's plenty that of... That women from Amisad are the most beautiful. No, but I'm not talking about beauty. But the world is full of beautiful girls. Mm -hmm. South America, Israel, Europe. But from Novi Sad, I think you have like a kind of, I call it a seventh, seventh sense. Mm -hmm. Guys, you cannot around with Tamara. You know it's... Uh, really? My no. video will get demonetized for you swearing. No. Maybe... Uh, no. But it's true. You cannot... No, you cannot... Uh, like, I mean, uh, to be honest, I have no secrets. But with Tamara, it's always like she That's knows That's the Pisces everything. intuition, baby. I'm a Pisces, my love. It's the Pisces intuition. But that's not the reason why I know why you're wrong. The reason why when you were sick. The reason why I know is because I went five years to university. I studied for five years. Yeah, but you know, it's honestly, you're really good in... Uh diagnostic yes. stuff. But it was always my strength because in like University of Bright, like, well in every pretty much uh, university of in England, you do like... Baby, can I take uh, your space for a little thing? Yes. We miss you Virgil so much. Oh, baby, now you make me a bit emotional and I was in like a bit of a funny mood. No, no, go. So you study five years. And then uh, like in April you have the OSCE exam, which is like an experiential exam where you have to like diagnose, you have to speak to a patient, all of this kind of stuff. So I had my placement in hospital. I had my placement in everything. People, my people know that. So, you know. No, but guys, I swear, I swear. Also, all my friends, whenever they have something, they, they call me to ask Tamara. There is something. She knows also, everything. All my friends, they always call me but it also helps that if i have no answer for example sometimes which it could happen or i need a second uh, opinion i call my parents or my sister and together we can always figure out what's going on and diagnose well we're not doctors we just and if i don't know the answer i'm not sure then i would definitely not uh, give like uh, i would not you know what i mean 
Yeah. Because that can be kind of dangerous. Are you excited maybe for these holidays? To be honest, this is now the starting holidays because now it's real. So how many swimming suits did you bring? Unfortunately, only one. Only one swimming suit? Yep. One swimming suit? Yes. Two. Two. One and two. That's it. I'm, I'm shook, guys. My soul is like... I'm you are a caveman! I know you are a caveman, but who brings two swimsuits? I brought like 22. Like, I'm really... And for the first time ever, I wore the Hermes uh, bikini. I will insert the picture so that you guys can see it. Ah, uh, baby, you wanted to do the laundry. Yeah, we have, you have to. to do the paperwork. I'll update you guys when we finish unpacking because I'm rambling too much and I'm not actually seeing anything useful. News? Unpacked. Holiday Maybe wardrobe at its finest. You want to be the good. woman of the century, you put all your product here Me. for your makeup. I am a woman of the okay. century. Well, at least for you. Every man's woman should be his woman of the century. But this is so nicely organized, I have to say. Right? Yep. And just the only thing left to unpack are the bags. We brush up fine. We dressed up. Guys, ready. I even decided to add a bit of jewelry tonight, so I'm wearing my Cartier Jason Clou, my Van Cleef bracelet added to my Cartier Love. I keep wearing the same ear mix. There we go. And tonight, ladies and gentlemen, I got on this Saint Laurent midi dress. Wait, can you see? No, you can't really see, but I love this dress so much. I will link it below because I think it's stunning. Good evening. I think this is going to be outfits from Montenegro video, if anything. Tonight, I am wearing, ladies and gentlemen, for the, I think, second time, really, my sparkly Prada top. Let me show you better weight. Baby, will you help me show my outfit? My face, sorry, I have like a candy in my mouth. My face, 20 shades lighter than my body forever. I always wear hats, sunglasses, and SPF 20,000. As we are creatures of habit, we're going for the same place tonight for dinner. However, we're going for a little walk first. Wearing these Valentino baggy pants, they're very like light. I know you're thinking probably why would you wear denim on holidays, but this is not traditional denim, right? Yeah. Actually, the outfit was kind of your idea. Credit where credit's due. We got the sparkly Prada top that I got in Capri. I'm in Amadis and I'm wearing a black, well, carrying a black mini Kelly. And that's it. Just wash my hair so it's still a little bit wet. Can you show us the, the bag? Yes. And here she is. Ta da! Love it. Love the look. Yes? Love it. That's because it. it's so cool. Your girlfriend. We're both allergic to lilies, so the lilies unfortunately are sleeping outside. I'm very allergic to lilies. Yeah. That's why I was like immediately had to take them out because Philip we cannot stand them. And now we're going for a little walk. Should we bring the camera? We should, 100%. Okay. Let's go. How beautiful is the sunset? Don't you think it's beautiful? It's on the other side. We will see it when we go to Tapasakia, which is there where you can see the light. It's gonna be so stunning. Not the best light, but we're two people that really like to do the things that work. So, habitual people. Squadra che vince. Non se cambia. Non si cambia. I guess that, baby. Oh. Anyway, excited for my. Well, miso, miso soup. So good. Spicy edamame. Yes. Even spicy though last night I had my spicy, <laughs> spicy edamame baby, and my nose was running. Right? Yeah. Well, it was so spicy. It's better if we had a normal one. Hello. But I liked it. Good morning, guys. Yeah. Messy bed in the background. What can I tell you? I. This is our second morning in Porto Novi. We're the one and only at the moment, where we went last year as well. And honestly, I'm not taking any pictures. I'm barely doing any stories. I'm really enjoying my time. The only thing is that occasionally I do like to show you my outfit for the vlog because I know you guys like that. So this is what I'm wearing today. This is the swim that is from, I don't know if you can see from Chanel, from the last collection. It's kind of like a bit of a weird one because you have to wear something underneath and I'm wearing this bikini underneath. Got my famous, beloved Leve shorts. These Chanel sunglasses, look at them. They say Chanel on this side, and on this side just a tiny little logo. They're so dirty, I need to clean them, I cannot see a thing. And I got a scarf. I got a scarf when we were going on holiday to Costa Rica, I'll insert the picture. And I am heading out, because you guys know that your girl is in desperate need cleaning the glasses with the Hermes linen pants, because this kind of material just tends to clean it the best. But, you know, it is what it is. 
Anyway, I am so ready for that first coffee of the day, guys. You know how much I love the first coffee of the day. I'm gonna have maybe my Duro Ginza sandals, and that's it. I think like I messed something up when I was sleeping because I have pain in the chest and I think it's a nerve that got stuck. I booked a massage for yesterday because it was a really rainy, horrible weather in the morning, but then I never actually ended up like going for it. I had to cancel it because the sun came out for those last two hours of the day and I just wanted to enjoy the sun. So that's it. Are you guys ready? Let's go to the beach. You know it's an upload day if I have my computer at the beach. I mean, it's not so bad. It's very windy, so I hope you guys will be able to hear me. Ah! Almost dropped, Vivi. We're gonna try our best to close this vlog here because we're gonna be watching it today. I'm gonna leave the beach because it's too windy and I need to give you my final word for Montenegro. We have three more nights here, which we just prolonged today. We were supposed to leave tomorrow, but we're going to Italy right after Montenegro. And Filippo was like, you know what? I don't want to go to Milan for a day to repack, unpack, and then to go to Italy. Why don't we just fly straight to Naples? And I was like, you know what? It's a great idea. We anyway have to unpack, repack a million times a year for various different reasons and trips. So let's just enjoy our holidays as we can. We're going to Ravello right after here. So since I will not have any new clothes <laughs> to present you because I only traveled with one suitcase, like few pairs of shoes, you've, you've seen it. I actually placed a huge order on, online for the remainder of my holidays because we will be in Ravello for like four or five days and I will vlog from there. But I hope you don't mind that the next three days that we are in Montenegro, I will not be vlogging because I'm really enjoying the rest. Now my boyfriend just told me, we haven't even taken any Instagram pictures. You're not really like taking pics. The thing is, we're really loving this content free time, you know? So that's the honest verdict. The honest, true story is such that we basically are loving holidays, especially me, if I may say so. So next time you see me, wait, today's Wednesday. I think on Sunday we'll already be in Ravello, but perhaps I won't have the vlog ready from there. So there'll be something maybe in between. We'll see what. But one thing I can tell you is that this is my buy from Montenegro, beautiful country. I have to say, beautiful nature, like the mountains, the sea. It looks a little bit like Lake Como because it is the sea, it's not the lake. But with the mountains and the water, it does remind both Filippo and me of Como. We are now, as you guys know, at the one and only. It's really like top level luxury, I have to say. Ooh, it's very dark now, I'm sorry. I hope you managed to see something from here other than just like a bunch of my outfits. But even if it was just a bunch of my outfits, I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you very soon. Since now I won't be vlogging, I will try and get a little bit better on my stories. So if you want to see what I'm up to in Montenegro, check out my Instagram. Love you guys. Bye.